Hey, it's a slow Friday night in the case. We've got just two games for you to offer, but there's exciting stuff in both of them. My name is Andrea Sachinger, and you're watching the KHL Update. We go to UFA first with Salavat Yulaev take on Spartak. The red and white won the first period of the season between the two 5-3 back in September. No scoring in the first, so pick it up from the second. Yuho Metzola has the puck behind the net, horrifically misplays it, and Anatoly Nikonsev makes him pay for that. Hit for the period now, Nikonsev plays the puck to the slot. Mikhail Yukov takes a shot on this one, rings off the pipe. Salavar bring it back to even late in the period. Sakari Manin has scored in his fourth consecutive game while his Phoenix compatriots team of Hardy Guy and Marcus Granlund draw the helpers. It goes to overtime. Philip Larson shoots from inside and the puck ends up in the net. Not gonna count though. It goes in off his skate and the ref calls kicking motion. Nine seconds of the extra frame. Salavar with a 2 on no rush, but they can't get the puck on net. Philip Larson with a golden chance. It goes to the shootout. Timo Hardikainen has to score in the fifth round to keep it going, and it does with a backhand shot through the five hole. Mikhail Grano scores in the extra round, and that proves to be the difference. Salavar to life with their fourth consecutive shootout and beats Spartak 2 1 on home ice. We travel to Patelsk, Moscow region now, where Vitas play host to Severstal. First period, Justin Bedford skates in on a partial breakaway, but he can get it past Dmitry Shugayev. A little later, Vladislav Rolnik takes a hard shot from the blue line, the puck is deflected and it hits the post. Moving on to the second, Kaspers Dalgavin stumps the puck in, Danforth picks it up on the rebound and beats Shugayev wide, 1-0 Vitas. Seristal tied up with a power play tally later in the period. Vladislav Kadala scores his fourth of the season. But Vitas get back in front just two minutes later. Better Malikin catches in on a power play as well. Off a cross ice saucer by the Nimue save. They improve their lead to 3 1 with another power play goal. It comes with just 10 seconds remaining on the clock. Justin Denford celebrates his second of the night and 12th of the season. The house put it away late in regulation as the Neil Pelinkov scores on the Yon and Ned. Vitas beat one of their key opponents and their four game losing streak and improves the lead in the season series against Aristotle to 2 0. 4 1 as you fly out. And that's it for the KHL update, but do come back tomorrow for five more games, including after Andalus vs. Torpedo and Red Army against Dynamo Mids. My name is Andrea Sachinka, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you again soon.